Assalamualaikum friend welcome back to another tutorial related to semantic manager for army okay so I have already created two videos related to semantic manager and I have just opened the same program okay uh, just for saving time I just uh, show you uh, this was the program we, we made last time okay so we'll go through very fast from 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 here uh, I just make all the things disable okay now okay now today what will we will learn so far we have learned the uh, normally open contact normally close contact and I have set the midline output I have made it this one all the pro all the logic which I use in the same program okay uh, so if you want to see if you want to watch the how we made this program uh, we created RS flip flop their differences we discussed in the last video so uh, I will put the I will put the description in the link so you can watch in the previous video so today what I'm going to t teach you about the set and reset memory bit S reset and set memory bit and how they are used what is the function of that so just uh, in a very fast way I just create another uh, network and here I'll take just uh, one any contact and one output and in other network I'll take same one input one output okay now what I want I want to tell you how the reset is work let's say I want to set memory bit m0.3 why I have taken I, I have why I take the 0 0.3 because I have taken m memory bit 0 0.1 and 0 0.2 so I just use 0 0.3 and same here I use 0 0.3 now what I want I want this memory bit to reset uh, by the any logic combination of the operation so let's say assume I is tell you that this is my output number one this is my output num uh, this is my output number one this is my output two this address is 0 0.01 this address is 0 0.1 0 0.1 so I want my memory m0.3 to set when this logic operation become true means when output 0, 0.0 is high the memory bit m0.3 should be set set means high okay and and even if any this logic operation becomes zero the memory bit q0.3 will remain high until and unless it is reset again so i want this memory address 0.3 to be set by the logic operation of output 1 and the same i want 0.3 memory address to be reset by the logic operation of network 2 means that zero point one so what I write address here Q 0.0, uh, 0 output 1 and this is Q 0 0.1 output 2 okay so uh, uh, now I show you uh, the how it is going to be work I just save it and download it please keep in mind when you download your simulator should be in the run P mode if the simulator is not in a start mode run mode your program will not be downloaded I just make it online okay now it is memory bit 0 0.3 is uh, off uh, okay it is sorry I uh, make it a mistake here I have to actually take set and I have to take this one actually set m0.3 and here I have to take uh, reset m0.3 same sorry for that okay uh, just save again and download again and make it operation now see m0.3 is neither set or reset by default this memory is actually having the value of 0 so first I'll make it set means high uh, what I log logic made it here I just made it either 0, 0.0 input or 0, 0.1 input both is a, in an AND gate if both is input is high this output will be high and this output will actually set the memory address 0 0.3 to set any means high 0 to 1 okay so let's say I make uh, come here 
just to show you 0, 0.0 and 0 0.1 I make from here 0, 0.0 now this memory bit is high output check error now this is set okay uh, you can see also this R is showing like a green some students and person confused that either it is set or reset so it is actually set uh, its value become from 0 to 1 how you can see uh, let me show you here I go there here and go to modify let's see I have put here memory address m0.3 its boolean logic is true mean it is high now the more important thing is that to observe here let's say I make this logic false means I remove either 0.0 or 0.1 see this output is now low q0.0 but the memory you see still it is here here you can see it is not high but in the memory you see it is still true m0.3 this is actually to monitor the real time data you can from here go modify if it's not showing here you just click this this button and from here to go to modify and write any address either input output or memory bit or byte whatsoever and you will see their current status in online status this is still true now how I now how will it will be reset for that I have make this combination with the output 2 when the output 2 will be high then this memory address will be set to 0 so output 2 is here and I'll just I make the logic I make the inputs in order to make it high all uh, any of this should be high let's say I make 0 0.2 this is high and I 0 0.3 if high then this output will be high now this output will be high see output 0 1 is still low and output 0 uh, dot 1 is high now this output actually made this memory to reset you see here now it is in false okay now it is in false so and the set and reset memory bit the advantage of is that uh, once it is set, set uh, if even though the logic behind is uh, false it will remain set and until unless you make it reset by forcefully or by any logic then it will be reset so it is very important use in the programming to make the you may say to store the uh, status of uh, your logic your operation you store the last status okay and then on the basis of this you take any actions to perform the operation of this one okay i hope you would like this video if you like please uh, don't forget to like subscribe and share among your friend thank you for watching till then till next video